You never know what surprises you're going to run into when you do an install, so make sure you have everything. This is a brief glimpse of some of the tools we're going to use for this installation. Our kitchen top is loaded, and off we go. Okay, we're now at the customer's house. We have the countertop all fabricated, but we have a really large island that we need to make sure is going to fit in here properly. So what we're going to do next is we're going to take the template and we're going to do a mock walkthrough. We're actually going to take it, make sure we can make the turns, and make sure we can install it properly. So let's get started. Remember to treat the template as if it's a piece of stone. Stone will not bend, so make sure you keep the template straight and stiff. If there are any obstacles in the way, now is the time to find out. When lifting stone, use the proper lifting technique. Use your legs. Careful not to scratch the front of the cabinets. Lift the stone, pivot it against the front of the cabinet, and with one single motion, smoothly lift it up onto the countertop. Continue bringing in the remaining countertops, setting them into place. Okay, we have our pieces all inside. We've all dry fitted them, but now we have several things we need to do yet. We have a small sink we need to cut out here in the island and also put a fixture hole here. Over on the large sink, we have to set the sink in, drill the fixture hole there. Then we're going to take care of our two seams and then we're gonna set everything in and we should be good to go. Remember in the shop when we scored the undermount sink, here we're finishing the cutout, placing our saw on the top, moving it slowly, watching where we're going making sure to keep a nice straight line. On our last cut, we'll put a suction cup over the cutout so it doesn't fall and continue the cut. Here we're pouring the fixture holes and you'll notice we're doing this dry with a dry core bit. We don't want to use water inside the house. Once your pieces are installed, you can now install the sink.